Hello, this is Lucas Mann from Rings of Saturn, and today we will be looking at the Flux Echo Pedal from Horizon Devices. Now, along with the Flux Echo Pedal, the awesome people over at Horizon Devices also gave me some packs of their Horizon Devices Progressive Tension Strings for my 8-string Legator guitar. They also gave me some Horizon Devices Jazz 3 Picks, both of which will be used in this video. Now, I really like the ends of these Horizon Devices strings because the ends are color-coded, which makes identifying which string go where very easy and fast when you change strings on your guitar. Also, the ends of every single string is tapered, opposed to just a couple, making it very easy and fast to go through those tuning pegs. Uh, also, the playability of these is great. Bending the notes is very easy, especially with the, the thin gauge on those higher strings on this eight string set. Uh, I recommend very highly. Now, as we head into the studio, I will be showing you three awesome sounds that I found with this pedal. You'll be able to see the settings on the pedal so you can replicate these tones. Uh, these sounds are very unique. I haven't seen many people do this type of stuff with this pedal. And um, first, I will be playing the guitar with no effects and then adding the pedal so you'll be able to see just how much this pedal brings your music to life. It's, it's incredible. Now, the Flux Echo Pedal has three different Flux modes that could be changed with this switch in the middle. In the up position, you have a reverse modulated delay. In the middle position, you have a warm analog delay. And in the bottom position, you have a tape style delay. Uh, these could all be changed with the knobs. Uh, the mix knob controls how much of the delay is in your tone and the tone knob controls whether the uh, delays are bright or darker and then you could of course control how much reverb and delay feedback you're getting with the other two knobs what's also really cool is that you have a tap tempo switch that you could um, use to time your guitar playing with and of course you have your bypass switch both there at the bottom. Some other cool features about the Flux Echo pedal is that if you notice on the sides it has two inputs and two outputs. This means that in certain applications you are able to put your delay into stereo. Also with the bypass switch if you hold it down you're able to enable reverb and decay trails. Awesome. Now as we head into the studio I will be using my Legator guitar with Horizon Devices strings. Uh, I will be using Horizon Devices picks I will be using the Precision Drive Horizon Devices pedal. I literally use it with everything. Uh, I will be using the Flux Echo pedal, of course. That's what the video is about. And I will be using the Kemper for the regular clean tones. <laughs> So for this first tone, I used the tape style delay. Um, after each arpeggio, it played an exact replica of that arpeggio right back at me. It created an awesome effect and I, I love that setting. Very cool. For the second tone, I use the warm analog delay. Uh, it's really cool because you could actually time it so your own notes harmonize with the delayed notes, which is what was happening in this tone. Um, you could create harmonization melodies or direct harmonizations. Very, very ambient, very atmospheric. Loved it. Loved it. For 
this last tone, I amped it up to max on the reverb modulation delay. Um, it creates this really cool like tremolo effect that I thought sounded super spooky uh, for some of my more dissonant style of playing that I use in my songs. So that was that was very neat to see there. So thank you all for watching my video on the new Flux Echo pedal from Horizon Devices. It's an awesome pedal that uh, I feel you should have in your arsenal of guitar tones. It's so good. It's so good. Um, I will probably be doing uh, some more videos on Horizon Devices pedals, including the Precision Drive. I've been using it for years. Another awesome pedal from Horizon Devices. Thanks again for watching. Also, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe for more content. Thanks.